I just wanted you guys to hear that epic music. So anyways, um, today I'm going to be starting a Skyrim Let's Play. To, um, to be honest, I have never played any of the Elder Scrolls games, so it's going to be pretty interesting to see me fail. And like I said in Uncharted 3 Let's Plays, I'm only going to be commenting certain parts so you can hear the voices and the cutscene parts in this game. Not much uh, talk right here, so um, it's going to be pretty difficult to do this let's play because I barely watch any walkthroughs or playthroughs on YouTube or let's plays of Skyrim. So uh, I'm going to have to take wild guesses at what to do next. Um, if I am on something for too long, I will skip ahead as I will in a bit though because I was stuck on something, but it was actually a blonde mistake. Finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Walked right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. If they hadn't been looking for you, could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there. You and me. We shouldn't be here. It's the Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in binds now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? The Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader of the Rebellion. But if they captured you... Oh, God. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going, but Sovereign Guard awaits. No, this can't be happening. This isn't happening. Hey, what village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Good. Let's get this over with. Sure. Mara, Debella. So practically these guys that I'm sitting with on this, uh, whatever you want to call it, they're going to get their heads chopped off. Look at him. General Tully is the military governor. For stealing a horse, I'm guessing. With him. Damn elves. I bet they had something to do with this. This is Helgen. I used to be sweet on a girl from here. Wonder if Vilod is still making that mead with juniper berries mixed in. Funny. When I was a boy, Imperial walls and towers used to make me feel so safe. Who are they, Dad? Where are they going? We need to go inside me. And this kid in the background won't shut up. Wait, like, why don't you just go in and play Pokemon? Like, you don't want to get, you don't want to watch these guys get their head chopped off, do you? Why are we stopping? Why do you think? End to, of the line. We're, we're stopping to die. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. Oh, wait, we're not rebels. Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got to tell them! We worked with you! This is a mistake! Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time! Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Raylof of Riverwood. Lokir of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel. You can't do this. Watch this guy get shot. Halt! You're not gonna kill me. Archers! I I used to hate the guards, but Anyone then I took an arrow to the knee. Running? Wait, you there? Step forward. Who are you? 
This part, you could choose which race you would like to select as your character for the whole game. Uh, I'm gonna be going through all these. You could just pause them. You could just pause to, to read about them if you would like. I find myself more of a melee, um, melee guy. Uh, what I mean by that is I don't like long range combat, like with bows and arrows and magic. I like to use swords and daggers, so I'm going to choose a Nord. And Nord is a race that looks a lot like a human. I don't want to look like some crazy elf that looks like it came from a different planet. And you to change your sexes. I want to be a male because I don't want to be a girl. It's pretty self explainable. And you to change your body, your face. And I found a weird thing in here because if you look to this guy and then this guy, like, seems like you lost quite a bit of weight. Uh, yeah, I was just playing around with it so for, for no reason. So anyways, you need to change your body stuff, you need to change your head, like your nose and your mouth and your... Sorry about that. You need to change all kinds of stuff, I guess. I don't want to get too complicated with my detail and texture, so I just kept it um, simple. I was just playing around with all these because I didn't know what dirt color meant on that. I'm gonna name my guy Pickler. I was planning on naming it like Douchebag or something. But, you know. You picked a bad time to come home to Skyrim, Kinsman. Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Forget the list. He goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. At least you'll die here, in your homeland. Follow the captain, prisoner. If you're wondering what the block is, the block is the place where they chop off your head. Um, pretty much, a, it's a sad place, sad thing. Oh, and Frick Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero and something you do not want to encounter. To murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. What was that? It's nothing. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Aetherius, Blessings of the Eight Divines upon you. For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over. As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. Can you say the same? Rated E for everybody. Well, looks like I'm next. As fearless in death as he was in life. Next, the Nord and the Rags. There it is again. Did you hear that? I said, next prisoner. To the block, prisoner. Nice and easy. Watch this guy, see? okay? Don't watch this big guy. To 
this practically sums up what Obli Oblivion, or whatever the heck the other Elder Scroll game was, I think. Um, Skyrim is getting to taken over by dragons practically, and you have to save Skyrim. So that's practically what the plot is of this game. So I kind of spent a lot of time doing this, but it just took one simple thing to do. So in a bit, I'm going to be skipping ahead um, to save time. What is that thing? Could the legends be true? We just need to move some of these rocks clear away. So all I had to do is just jump over this dragon onto this little house, or wherever that this is, a shadow, or I don't know where it is. Whoa, that kid runs fast. Okay, so what I gotta do is I gotta follow this guy. Still alive, prisoner. Keep close to me if you want to stay that way. Brother, take care of the boy. I have to find General Tolias and join the defense. God's guide you Stay close to the wall! Quickly, follow me! I think they're attempting to shoot down the dragon. Uh, don't know what to say about that. You guys aren't blondes, are you? Out of my way! We're escaping, Hathar. You're not stopping us this time. Fine. I hope that dragon takes you all to Sovereign Guard. You come on into the gate. With me, prisoner. Let's go. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. Was that really a dragon? The bring us of the end times? Yep, it was a dragon. Keep moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. There you go. Hadvar. There should be plenty of gear to choose from. Who I'll names? See if I can find something for these books. Oh my god, dude, shut up. Who names their kid Hadvar? So anyways, I uh, hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, Sally ends here, so give it a give it a thumbs up and favorite.